Hey guys, it's me Drew, and I am here to do my Day After Christmas Boxing Day haul. Now, for the Boxing Day haul, I went to Yankee Candle, L'Occitane, The Body Shop, and Bath and Body Works. I'm going to start off with, um, oh, and I went to Sephora just to get two items that weren't really on sale or anything. The one item is the Argon Oil Light by Josie Marin because I love, 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 love the Argon Oil. But you can't use that on the day, during the day, because it's so, you know, it's oily and it's going to leave you oily all day. That's good for night. So the Argon Oil Light is great for the day. Everybody, all the beauty gurus, rave and rave and rave about Clean On Me by Soap & Glory, which is a clarifying shower gel with body lotion built in. And this was $16. Oh, by the way, they, um, that was 48 the Josie Marin Argon Oil Light. But the Clean On Me is absolutely amazing. And my assistant over there shaking the camera, Miss Nicole, I absolutely love... Stop shaking it or it'll go out of focus, please. Just get away from the camera, please. Can you go in your room now? Thank you. So, those were the two items that I picked up from Sephora. Then, from Bath and Body Works, I didn't pick up any candles this time. I got a creamy body wash in Paris Amour, and I believe this was like five bucks or something like that. I love the creamy body wash, and I couldn't find many choices, so I grabbed a Paris Amour. I grabbed two Aromatherapy Sleep Body Lotions in Warm Milk and Honey with the matching shower gels because I love the warm milk and honey scent and when I found these for six dollars a piece I had to pick some up. My manager in my store just told me about the True Blue Spot Apricot and White Tea Supremely Smoothing Face Scrub. This was also on sale. Now see this is a new camera so I can't go like this or it won't be focused so I have to go like this. I don't know how it works. It's a Canon Rebel T3i. Please help explain to me what this is. I'm very confused. I don't really know. But anyway, this is that True Blue Spa Face Scrub. It's amazing. So I have one in the shower now, and I picked up one, two, three, four, five, six. Then I picked up some Wallflower 2-pack refills, because I love them. I picked up Autumn, which is just an amazing leafy scent, pomegranate scent. I picked up a Cranberry Pear Bellini, and I already have one in my kitchen now. I picked up a Frosted Cranberry, every person's favorite scent ever, Leaves, Marshmallow Fireside, and these were like six bucks a piece, Sparkling Icicles, Tiki Beach, which I was really excited about because I'll use that for the summertime. With the Wallflower Bulbs, it doesn't matter if they're like last year or anything like that because you don't see the label. Winter Candy Apple. Island Colada, Mint Chocolate, Passion Flower, which I also have one going in my room. Can you go see what Roxy's doing, please? Okay. And make sure Mommy doesn't come in here, because I don't. I'm making a video. <laughs> Sicilian Orange. See, I don't know if you can see that blurry or not. Sicilian Orange. Gelato, Honeysuckle, and two White Barn Renew and Refresh, which are my favorites. So that is basically all that I purchased from Bath and Butter. It didn't do a lot of damage. Then I went, oh, I also picked up the Paris Nights Shower Gel and Lotion. It's one of my friend's favorite scents, so I decided I'd just pick that up for her. Then I went to the body shop and the body shop, which, okay, first, I don't know how long this memory card is going to last, so I have a lot of stuff from L'Occitane, so I'll probably just make a separate video on that. But the body shop, they had four body butters for five bu bucks each that I didn't have. They're the n not new ones, but online exclusives, retired ones. So I picked up the Passion Fruit, which smells amazing. It's purple. It's just so bright and summery. Papaya, which um, I'm not really a big fan of it, but I didn't have it, so I picked that one up. 
blueberry, which is the older packaging. Oh, got a little on my nose, but it smells absolutely amazing. And I love how new they look. It smells just like a fresh blueberry. And my favorite, which I might have to pick up some more, is sweet lemon. And for five bucks a piece, you can't beat it. Oh my god, it's so bright and just crisp lemon. I absolutely love it. Then I went to good old Yankee Candle. I wasn't going to buy anything, but I saw the, a couple things that I wanted. First off, the Thanksgiving candles were $7 a piece. I did not ever pick them up because I feel like $30 is a lot for something I'm not even really going to like. But I picked up all three because I wanted to, um, just to have them. Cranberry sauce, which I already started to burn. And it smells just like cranberry sauce. This is my favorite out of all of them. Literally smells like that jelly cranberry that you would buy at the store. Sweet potato pie, which to me you could burn all year long. I haven't started to burn this yet, but you smell that sweet potato, the honey, marshmallow, everything. Turkey and stuffing. That's absolutely disgusting. It smells just like turkey stuffing. It smells like stovetop stuffing, to be honest with you, and I don't like it, but for $7, it was a fun novelty scent. That was one time I went, and then the other time I bought some turmeric tumblers. I picked up a vanilla chai, which smells just like chai tea with a hint of vanilla. I love chai tea. Then, Lake Sunset, because this reminds me of the Wen 613 Cleansing Conditioner, and it's just absolutely incredible. It's very nice, very fresh. Just awesome. This one, I was never going to pick up. I smelled it, loved it. Sad that it's being discontinued already, but Sunflower. It's just so bright, yellow, crisp, summery. Yum, yum, yum. It's so floral, so just absolutely incredible. One I got in a jar because I didn't have any other tumblers left. And I'm so sad that this is being discontinued. Blueberry scone. Very, 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 very upset. Just a fresh, fresh field of blueberries with that bakery, the whipped cream. Then I got for $8 a medium pure radiance candle in creme brulee. Yum, yum, yum. This is my favorite pure radiance candle ever. And for 8 bucks for a medium, I love it. Absolutely love it. Now, my assistant, Nicole, can please stop my camera for me. Can you please go to my camera? And whenever I point to you, you can turn it off. Because, again, I'm very new at this. I don't know a whole lot. That little button that you press. Not yet. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. What'd you say? Can you be in the end? She wants to be in the end. Come here, Nicole. Hey. Hey. Oh, this is hard. Don't knock my light over. That's my sister, Nicole. Until I get a remote for my camera. There she is. She has her Frozen shirt on, which is the best movie ever. So please go over to my camera and stop it. Because I don't know how to autofocus. Let me know if this video is good or not. I mean, I'm still going to watch it to see how it is. Looks pretty clear in the little view box. Not yet, Nicole. In the little view box, I like that. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. And... Oh, it is the new year. So, Happy New Year, everybody. I'll talk to you later. Bye. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. <laughs> Bye.